reshaping his brain. How's it going guys? I'm your host Carbon Gaming. Welcome back to the next episode of the Let's Play Dragon Fable series and today we're going through the next part of the first Weaver Saga, The Feast. Uh, so this has been a pretty dark storyline as we've seen so far but that has been the case for most of the book tree storylines so honestly I can't really say I'm surprised but let's look at what these seem to be beehives? Okay and here we are. Okay looking through the story of Val and Raw. Six, seven, eight, not eight. That could be a tavern. Let's say approximately three people live in each. What are you counting? Houses. Why? Isbor. 14. Isbor. He's calling you. Hmm? Isbor. That's the name of the person you are wearing. Oh, thank the shapeless. You're all right. What are you doing? I'm happy you got away safely. You did, didn't you? That guy didn't hurt you? If he did, did. Who are you? His name is Ludomia. Uh, try to keep up, otherwise people get suspicious. Are you messing with me? Oh, of course I am Ludomia. Why would you do that? You gave me quite a scare. I thought he shot you in the head and you had amnesia or something. Oh boy, if only it was that simple. If only. Silly. Well, quick, who am I to this person? How should I know? Find out on your own. I've already told my father that someone attacked us in the woods. Of course, he wasn't happy that we were in the woods. You know, because of that one time a foreign visitor came. Anyway, that's gathering people to check the forest now. They'll find a body. No. Everything is alright now. The one who attacked us ran away. But he might come back and he was asking about more time. We should warn them. Do something. I've said everything is fine. It's alright now. There is no need to worry. When he was running away, he... tripped, And the whole earth... And the earth swallowed him whole. And then... <laughs> And he fell into the stream and drowned. How can you drown in a stream? <laughs> you can, but forget it. There was no stream. He tripped then. Ah, uh, forgive me. It is what happened. Was well, so dreadful. It's making me nauseous just thinking about it. I, I need to collect myself. Oh, I'm sorry, Izzy. Izzy? It's fine. What I was trying to say, that man is of no danger to anyone anymore. Okay, well, I'm just glad you're safe and sound. I'll go tell the good news. See you later. Well, that was touched me. You're not made from sand, you won't crumble. This ball, he must have had a house somewhere around here and I'm exhausted. You tired? I thought, you thought what? They had lost your humanity a long time ago, of course. What, what does it have to do with me being tired? Hmm. I have to think about it. Sai, why did they allow you to speak to me? <laughs> Man, I love this inner monologuing. Who's this, the mayor or something? Oh no, this is raw. Expedition was a tremendous success. Even after removing a piece of the mana core that was ejected during the original disturbance, the area around the fissure remains stable and is of no immediate threat to our world. The piece is being safely transported to the capital, where it will undergo a further study under the watchful eyes of the Magisterium. Truly, this is a great day for our nation. A new age for the shapeless empire has dawned. A piece of the mana core. This could be it. The means of ascending. I need to leave. Father of mine, are you there? Father? Oh, this is Bell Tail. Get dressed and come with me. Where are we going? It's a surprise. Go with him, this ought to be interesting. Well, it's not like we can say no, right? Ta da! I can't go into water, Bell, especially not into hot water. The disguise will wrinkle and fall apart. Make excuses, figure something out. Thank you, Ludomia. Ludomia, but I really don't feel like it. Well, suit yourself. I'm jumping in. You sit somewhere. Close your eyes. What is he doing? Did he figure me out? No, he's undressing. It's good to have some time to ourselves. What are you thinking about? That I should wear more red. The mana core piece. Is it still in the capital? As far as I know, yes. Why do you ask? Ludomia, you'll do anything for me, correct? What are you doing? Of course, Izzy. Besides, tomorrow's your birthday. How convenient. I want you to draw a circle around the village. Here. We are going to include these symbols outside of the circle, not inside. Outside. Tell me when you're done. Why? It's a game. Alright, this is really weird, but it's your birthday soon. Hey, what? If it's a game, then let's do this together and make it a race. Whoever can draw a part of the circle faster wins. 
There is a rock with this blue moss on it on the far side of the village from here. Let's draw the circle from here to there. The first by the rock wins. I agree to your terms. Let's go. Hold up, I need to put on some clothes first. A race to join some weird circle, which I'm sure can't be anything good. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. Sure. Oh, ah. Oh, this is interesting. Why do we not see more of this mechanic in South Quest? I think this is the only one? Yeah, okay. It's probably a, quite a fair bit of work for them to do this, but yeah, why do we not? More of this. I don't know. Uh, is it cause other quests don't call for it or what? But oh my god, this is actually pretty fun and interesting, and it makes the quest more unique than the standard. You know, run through the whole thing. Yeah, why do we not have more of these? And this is multi hit too. Yeah, that's how crazy it is. Okay. You can see just how disturbing the stuff. I look at this bird with the. This looks like regular female hair and like some sort of creepy ass face on it. Like, oh my god. Book tree, man. Really, really dark. Oh, we got another one. Like a new car. Okay. Oh, yeah. Somebody commented in my previous video that this is more like Chaos Weaver than it is Flash Weaver. So, yeah, yeah, you're right. <laughs> Yeah, I get weaker or something. Feels like I did. Not doing as much damage. Who's gonna win? If he wins, we kill him, right? <laughs> I should be the only one winning. Oh man, 38 health really. Okay, done. Seven HP, damn it. I seem to be losing a fair bit of health. I need to be a bit more careful. I mean, there's not much I can do except chuck potions. Oh, 19. Come on. Alright. Well, hello there, guy. I won. Congratulations. What took you so long? I was being delayed. By what? Woodland creatures. I thought they usually keep to themselves. What do you do? I had to. Sing to them and they left me alone. I see. Anyway, now that we are done, what was the purpose of it? We are not done. Find a bottle and place it in the middle of the village. Carve or draw the same symbols on the bottle as you did on the ground. Okay, this is getting really weird. I will not do it unless you explain yourself, mister. The purpose of it is to summon the rain. I... The first purpose of it is to summon the rain. So, is it magic? Yes? No magic? Oh boy, I, I don't know if I can help you with this. We common folk can't do magic. If the people find out, you'll have to go to the... <laughs> Enough! Oh, I can't do this anymore. What are you doing? I'm reshaping his brain to do what I want him to. I'm sick of this charade. Wow, reshaping his brain. Dark man, you go to the village, take a bottle, carve the symbols and put it in the middle of, uh, put it in the middle of the village now. I know what this circle means. Well congratulations. Do you want a standing ovation? It's Tanislav's last will. Bravo, outstanding. Your disguise is coming off. It doesn't matter anymore, I'll find a new one. Why are you doing this ritual on this village? You didn't figure it out, shame. You are on a roll. Holy moly. Okay, it can only get worse from now, of course. My god, that was horrific and the screams though. Father of mine, let's go. Next one. Uh, 
turn up the volume a little so I can hear. Die. Oh. Shapeless. Oh, oh, it's in that direction. Oh! They use the soundtrack? The No, did they use the wind FX sound from AQ? I swear that sounded like it. I know what that was. Belltale? This happened once, a long time ago, before I was born in Mortem. Well, what a coincidence. I've just been reading about this. Here, the study of forbidden magics. Ativa, Bose. RST Ah here Tennislev's last will who, who would do such a thing? My father What? This is very very bad Hold on How can it be your father? Isn't he dead? He left I don't know if he died Even so it has been a very long time Since you or your father was alive You don't understand My father is obsessed with immortality It is possible that he might have achieved it Alright let's assume your father is still alive How can it be sure it was him Who just now cast the spell? I just know Since that very moment I sensed it it's a peculiar kind of feeling. We need to go, we need to investigate, and most importantly, we need to make sure everyone is alright. I doubt that. Yeah, I doubt it too. You doubt that, really? Certainly, Idilia University is quite an accomplishment, and I'm sure he will be proud. So yes, I doubt that he will be indifferent. Oh, did I say indifferent? I meant to say he won't even care. He didn't even raise us. He was never around. He's always busy, either ruling Mortem or spending entire days locked in his study, doing shapeless knows what. I don't know why I even agreed to help you. What? You'll run Idilia all by yourself? Face the facts, Belle. Our father doesn't love us and our family is falling apart. We should have figured out that out after we all learned how he treats our mother. Oiva, you have been quiet this whole time. What do you think? I just want a happy family. Please, just come with me. Oh. There we can see Secundus. Father of mine, I will have to leave you soon. We have fin finished building the Idelia University. I've done all I could to set you on this path. A place where everyone who wishes to follow in your footsteps can learn how to coexist with the elemental spirits, to learn the craft of soul weaving, and to form bonds of friendship that will last lifetimes. But before I go, I have one last piece of advice for you. That... Uh, what? Do you hear anything I just said? He's interrupting you. Why are you interrupting me? I, I've just lost my train of thought. I can't focus when you are interrupting me. He always does this. You always do this. Make him go away. Go find something else to do and leave me alone. Now listen carefully. Come, Oiva. Okay, you're right. So they just shoot him away. Not a good father, guys. That's not how you be a father. You had a soul ally, huh? Soul ally, you had a soul ally. A red one when you were alive. Um, I mean, you are alive now, obviously. Well, when you were in your original body. Shoot. What are you babbling about? You had a soul ally, yes. And he was an elemental spirit. Your point being? You didn't eat him? I thought you ate spirits as well. I didn't eat that one. Secundus, he was with me from the very beginning. He guided me through life. Wait a minute, how do you know about him? Oh, you know, I know things. Secret things. No, you don't. I'm inside of you. I know everything you know. And I know everything you know. When will you finally disappear? Maybe I'm already dead and you're imagining me. So where are we going now that you have eaten an entire village full of innocent people? The capital of the Shapeless Empire. Oh, sounds grand. What? What are you doing? If you are trying to annoy me even more, it's working. I wouldn't dare. I'm sorry if I clicked a bit too fast through some things. It's just my mouse having this stupid double click issue. Everyone is gone. Unforgivable, but time for morning will be later. The spiritual residue is strong. I can definitely track him. Eat away. Hey, the pursuit has begun. Okay, do we go in for another one? I think we save it for the next episode. Wow, almost at the end already. From the Citadel, we learn Mazena. I can do two quests per episode. It's going to be two more episodes. Okay, guys, I hope you guys have enjoyed this very exciting episode of the first Weaver Saga. If you have, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and of course subscribe to this channel if you guys want to see more of such future content. Till the next time, I'm your host, Carbon Gaming. Peace out.